every time I fucking do these things, my face is like, hey, today, I want to be a goddamn pizza. What is going on? And welcome back to Black Entertainment and another Thursday video! Woo! 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 As you can tell, I just smoked three bags of Mary Juana. I'm just really hyped to be doing another Thursday video for you guys. Unfortunately, we missed last week's Thursday video, so that means this video has to be twice as good to make up for it, I think, because we missed one, so we gotta do two, and that's like one plus one is two. So welcome back, you guys, to Black Entertainment. Like always, it is very, very appreciated for you guys all tuning in. I really, really do appreciate it. And happy, happy New Year's, you guys. Happy 2014. Hopefully you guys had an awesome year in 2013. Hopefully all your dreams came true. I don't know. Maybe you did your first kiss or had your first kiss. Not really did your first kiss. That doesn't even make any sense. Yeah, but hopefully you had your first kiss. Uh, maybe you got your first girlfriend or girls. Maybe you got your first boyfriend. I don't even know. Let me know down in the comments. What was your highlight of 2013? I know that question is super overplayed. Everybody's like, hey man, what did you do in 2013? That was cooler than the previous year. I don't know. Dur, dur, dur. Uh, but anyways, you guys, I really want to know though. Seriously, comment down below. Um, I'm trying to be serious with you guys. I'm just really pumped up right now. Uh, yeah, but what was your highlight of 2013? What really, really stood out that year? Uh, mine probably personally was how much growth this channel had. Uh, I, if you guys watched yesterday's video, I kind of stated it in that video uh, at the beginning of 2013 this channel only had about around 2,000 subscribers and by the end of 2013 we are damn near 60,000 subscribers uh, so that's definitely my highlight of the year and I can't I mean I couldn't have done it without you guys so I really want to say thank you you guys definitely made this whole YouTube thing for me you guys are the ones who helped me reach this goal uh, so thank you for that I really really do appreciate it and uh, yeah we just got really serious right there all right, so good old-fashioned Thursday videos. Let's go right ahead and jump into some would you rather questions from some of you fucked up people who leave fucked up things in the comments. I don't know what goes through your guys' head when you write these, but they're so awesome. All right, so starting things off, we got 3Dog who asks, would you rather have the webbings between your fingers cut open and pour lemon juice on the cuts or have a razor blade shoved up your asshole? How do you think of that? That's 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 pretty that's pretty fucked up. That's pretty fucked up, three dog. These are things you shouldn't comment this stuff because I gotta answer these questions and it's hard for me to answer these. But I'm honestly gonna have to probably go with cut the webbings in between my fingers. If you guys don't know what webbings are, uh, these are the webbings right in between your fingers. Bam, 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 bam. Uh, so he wants you to cut those open, pour lemon juice on it so it stings like a bitch, and uh, yeah, and then it heals up. That's the thing. See, razor blades shoved in your asshole, that's going to hurt like a bitch. Like, those are going to have to come out. Let me remind you, you can't live with razor blades in your asshole. I mean, maybe you can. Maybe you could, like, be on Guinness World Records or something. Uh, but, yeah, three dog, I'm going to have to go with cut the webbings in between my fingers and pour lemon juice in them. I think that's the right one to pick. I don't know. Let me know what you guys pick. All right, then we got Fat Kid TV who asks, would you rather be scalped Scalped. Would you rather be scalped? I'm guessing you mean like skinned alive. I'm guessing that's what that means. I don't know. So we're going to say, would you rather be skinned alive or would you rather be tickled for so long that you can't breathe and suffocate? I hate being tickled. I'm ticklish. If my feet, my ribs, my penis, but like I'm ticklish everywhere. So that's a tough one, but being skinned alive or scalped, uh, it's definitely something I don't want to do. That's definitely not on my agenda for 2014. Uh, so I'm probably going to have to go with tickled uh, so long that you can't breathe and suffocate. Because, I mean, yeah, you're going to die in that situation. But that's a lot better. Like, that's a better way to go than being skinned alive. Because I'm pretty damn sure you're going to die that way too. And if you don't die, you're going to be living a life of misery. Uh, so, Fat Kid TV, I'm going to have to go with get tickled until I suffocate. Seems like the good answer. All right, next up, we got Charles Espinoza, who asks, Would you rather be part of a human centipede? Ugh. Ugh. Or relive the worst day of your life every time you wake up. Okay, so basically you're getting butt-fucked, uh, or you are living the worst day. That's see Oh, my God. 
Why do you guys do this to me? Okay, Charles Espinoza, this this is gonna get this is gonna get really awkward, but I'm probably gonna have to go with the human centipede one. Because human centipede is once, although that is probably the most fucked up situation you can get yourself into, and it is absolutely disgusting, and you're gonna regret it every waking day of your life. I think it's better than reliving the worst day of your life every time you wake up. Because if you relived the worst day of your life every single day, you would probably want to kill yourself. Like, there's nothing basically to look forward to uh, because every day is going to be shitty. Nothing is ever going to go your way. Uh, so I'm probably going to go to the human centipede thing one time and live the rest of my life trying to not remember that. All right, the next up we got Tupatino. Tupatino. He asks, would you rather jump into a pool filled with razor blades? What is up with all my subscribers and razor blades? Is this like an ongoing thing? Uh, or get paper cuts all of your body, leaving nothing but scabs. Can you guys give me some sexual questions, please? Can you be like, hey, would you rather uh, do a blonde girl in the butt or do a brunette in the vagina? Like, I like those questions. What is up with these questions that really, really hurt and leave nothing but pain inside of my mind? Uh, but okay, Tupatino, I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong, I have no idea. Your name reminds me of Tupac, that's exactly what I see there. Um, I would probably have to go with uh, get paper cuts all over my body leaving nothing but scabs. Uh, jumping into a pool filled with razor blades seems a lot more dangerous and I feel like a lot more things could go wrong in that scenario. Uh, so I'm probably going to have to go with uh, the paper cuts leaving nothing but scabs. Uh, I hate paper cuts. Like, I get a paper cut on my finger and I start crying because I'm a bitch. Uh, but it just seems like the, uh, a better thing to do than jumping into a pool of razor blades. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. That one's, that's a pretty good one. Uh, I really like that one. And then, uh, next up is Led Zepp 11 Gaming. I don't know if you're Led Zeppelin? Ooh, Led Zeppelin in 11. Led Zeppelin Gaming. I hope that's what it means or else I look like a fucking retard. Uh, ass, would you rather get penetrated in the ass by an elephant with hot sauce on his dick? What? What? Okay, where are you from? Like, how do you think of that? How? H how? Penetrated in the ass by an elephant with hot sauce on his dick. You know what to do a bit of tapatio. Or, <laughs> god damn it, that's bad. Or give your dad a rim job while he gives his dad a rusty trombone. Oh my god. What is the matter with you? Were you raised normally? Were you raised with a pack of wolves? Actually, no. I don't even think wolves would do that. Okay, so, okay, this one is absolutely disgusting. I'm regretting uh, even saying this because now i got to answer it. Uh, I'm probably going to have to go with... Okay, I'm not getting penetrated in the ass by an elephant. Uh, we already talked about this in the last video. I don't want anything to do with like a penis in my butthole. Uh, so I'm going to put that one out of the question. And I'm probably honestly going to have to go with give my dad a rim job and, uh, while he gives his dad a rusty trombone. Because they're doing more dirty stuff than me. Like, yeah, rim, da rim job. If you don't know what that is, it's like, like you're licking a butthole, which is really gross. Uh, but that's a lot better than getting fucked in the butthole, I would think. So I'm going to have to go with that one, Led Zeppelin Gaming. Thanks for uh, making my rest of the day pretty shitty and having that thought in my head. I appreciate it. But anyways, you guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. I really, really do appreciate it. Again, if you want a question answered by me, uh, leave a comment down below asking your question. It could be anything. It could be would you rathers. It could be like personal questions. It could be uh, what do I do in this situation or something like I can get serious with you guys. I can get serious from time to time, uh, but just answer everything or not answer. Uh, Ask me some questions down below. All these questions from today were pulled straight out of the comments. Since you guys are so active, since you guys love these videos, all the likes, all the favorites, all the comments are what continues me to do these Thursday videos. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully we can have an awesome 2014. So thanks you guys for tuning into this video. Hopefully we can have another powerhouse of a year in 2014. So with that being said, you guys, thanks for tuning in. Like always, I really, really do appreciate it. And uh, with that being said, I'll talk to you guys next time. Have a wonderful rest of the day. Deuces.